Hey guys, if you're interested in how to get this quick and easy bun in less than five minutes, I'll show you the top. Or if you have short hair and you want an alternative to this bun on how to get the same exact look, stay tuned. Hey guys, welcome back for another video. Today I'm going to show you how to do a really simple high bun. Um, this is the way I like to do my buns and I hope that it helps somebody. So let's get started. So what I basically use is, instead of gel, I'm not really a fan of gel. I was when I was younger, but just being on my healthy hair journey, I really haven't found anything that I really love to slick down my edges really, really super smooth. So if you guys have any suggestions for good gels, let me know and leave them down in the comment box. But what I pretty much use is just Jamaican black castor oil. I feel like the consistency is thick enough to kind of hold my hair in place uh, throughout the day. So that's what I use. So I actually have my Jamaican black castor oil in this little applicator bottle. And what I do is I just pour a small amount. So about that much, it's kind of running. But a small amount I put on the front and the back, my nape, got to get the back area of my hair. So right now I just have my hair in a loose bun. This is not actually how the bun's going to come out. But then I take my really, really soft brush. I don't want anything pulling too much or too hard on my edges. So I have a, a soft brush. And I just take that and I just brush across my hairline really smooth and the back making sure that there's no you know bubbles or anything in the back of my hair and then I start to grab it into the position where I actually want my bun to sit and then I take a ouchless band and I just again smooth it up in the direction that I want my bun to sit in. Make sure that there's no bubbles or anything in the back. And I feel one. So if you ever feel one, you just take your brush and you just smooth it back into the palm of your hand. And then you take your band and whatever is comfortable for you, you wrap it around. I'm comfortable with three times because it's actually an older band and it's already stretched out. So three around is not, you know, it's not too tight for me. So then I'm just going around my hair, making sure that everything is all smooth. If you want to make sure that your hair is even more smooth, a, a little trick that I like to use is just take a fine tooth comb. You're not actually going through the ponytail, but you're just taking it and smoothing it across just lightly. Just to make sure those extra hairs are actually going smoothly into the ponytail. So after you've done all that, we're doing like almost like an umbrella shaped bun. So what you're going to do now is you're going to take your hair and you're going to spread it across. Almost like it's coming out of a spout. You're going to take it, spread it out, make sure that there's really no hair sticking out. And once you have it this way, I know it looks a little crazy, you're just going to wrap it. Wrap it until you have your desired shape. And hair is going to pop out a little bit. Once you have your shape in place, you just use a hairpin and you just pin, start pinning it all around. And this is where I like to actually sometimes make my bun a little bit bigger. If your hair just comes out in the front, just stick it back in.
Okay, so see right here, I have a piece that's actually sticking out. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to tuck that in and just reshape the bun in the back. Okay. If you feel any hair is not secure, then you just go back in and stick another bobby pin. Like so. Okay guys, so that's pretty much it. This is how you achieve a really quick and easy bun in less than five minutes. If you're looking for an alternative and you have shorter hair, I actually found this pop-on bun at my beauty supply store and I used to wear this actually when my hair was a little bit shorter. I used to look at some of the videos and say, oh my god, I love her bun, but my hair is just not quite that length yet. How do I get that same look? Well, here it is. All you simply do is you comb your hair up in a ponytail like I previously did in the video and you pop on this bun. The great thing about it is that it actually has pins in the inside that you can actually attach to your ponytail or if you're like me and you don't like the pins you can use hair pins the same exact way that I pinned my bun now or if you want to jazz it up if you want to just wear the the bun uh, plain as it is you can also dress it up with a cute little headband how cute is that and you can just put it across your head pop it on turn it to the side and you're ready to go. So thanks so much guys for watching. If you would like to see a tutorial on how to use um, this bun, please let me know and I'll do it for you guys. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe and I'll talk to you guys on my next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.